Hello guys and welcome back. My name is Lado and today we're gonna play some more League of Legends. We have left Summoner's Rift to go um, and find and actually fight an Aram on the Abyssal map. I think it's Abyssal. I don't really know the name of this map, but we're gonna play it anyways. So it's Aram, all random, all mid, and I was the unlucky guy to get this rocky mountain I should call him which is with um, which is his who listens to the name of Malphite so we're gonna play this guy and to be fully honest it's my first time playing Malphite I don't really know what to buy on him on him I know I know you have to go tanky on him but yeah we're just gonna play the recommended items I suppose why can't I buy it buy this what the hell? I can't. Oh, I'm probably not in the shop, right? Okay, yeah. Now I can buy stuff. I'm gonna buy the recommended items. Oh, let's see. We have actually. Oh, I'm gonna buy all our health pots and like one mana pot and go to lane because the game probably already has started. Yeah, there's already a fight going on and I'm not there, so I don't really know what to level up. Deal 70 magic damage and steal 14. Oh, and steals uh, movement speed. So we're gonna. Brutal strikes, Malphite bait hit units near his target. Okay, I'm gonna level this one. Uh, brutal strikes, so does it. Um, Malphite's armor and attack damage increase by 20%. Okay. Oh, let's see. They have a very pokey comp, so it's going to be really hard. Like they have Jinx, Caitlyn, Soraka to keep them alive, and all we have is mainly a Teemo who's gonna die almost. Ah, uh, we were able to do quite some damage against the Soraka. Let's see, uh, should back half, I suppose, and a Teemo walking into the Caitlyn trap, which is pretty dumb in my opinion. Just gonna spam uh, like my slow, but it's pretty much costs lots of mana actually. So let's see. Yeah, it costs really lots of mana. Actually, Malphite is pr might be a decent pick on Aram because you have, of course, your granite shield. So poke doesn't hurt you that much compared to other champions. Still, gonna it's going to be very hard. Gonna use my heal over here because it seems like my teammates could use it. Damn it. Oh crap. Oh, there's a heal. We definitely should pick. Timo gets it and the puppy dies. Sadly enough. So I don't really know how we're going to win this game. It's gonna be really tough. And like Caitlyn placing her traps, you like if you walk in a trap, you're dead. Because it probably will get followed up by a Nami bubble. So it's going to be insane. I'm gonna pick one. In ground slam, I suppose it lowers attack speed, I suppose, and does some damage. Yeah. Evelyn taking lots of damage, but no, they have like the Caitlyn and and Jinx, which have like which your traps are really annoying. Poppy walking into the trap you really shouldn't do that. Gonna back up right here. Because Kate, oh, and a Teemo gets killed. Trying not to take that much damage. Want to survive. Oh, the Soraka. Getting low by the tower. So let's see. Oh, she's pretty low, she's pretty low. If I could, could get like one more, how it's called, Seismic Shard. Oh no, she heals herself up, of course. Soraka way too OP on Aram. With the heals and stuff. Let's see if we can get her. No, probably not. I'm gonna walk out of this one. Although we were pretty close, to be honest. I need to back off. I don't have mana, so I can't really do that much. Uh, Timo picking up the kill. And a double kill for Soraka. Uh oh. Kinda sucks. Jinx using her ulti, so 
She doesn't have it right now. I'm real low on mana, so I'm gonna pop my uh, mana pot to get some more mana back. And actually, I'm also pretty low on health, so I'm gonna do my health pots. Because I don't want to get killed. Oh, come on! What the fuck? Okay. I thought Kha'Zix was about to pick up that one. It was best I picked it up because I needed both mana and health, while the poppy only needed health. I got my ulti, ulti. so how does this work? Okay, it was pretty good. Woo, I'm picking up the kill, doing the barrier to survive. And we picked up the second kill for our team. So that was pretty successful engage, I suppose. The Caitlyn was way too close to tower, taking lots of tower hits. Um, so Poppy is able to survive popping her ult. Timo should start placing out some shrooms. And whoa, what is this Soraka? What is this Soraka doing? Overstaying way too much. Gonna slow her with the ground slam. Picking up the kill. And a quadra or triple quadra kill for the Kha'Zix. Okay, this is really good for us because this will allow the Kha'Zix to really snipe, snipe off people really good. I totally didn't expect this one to happen. We were really the team pushed to the tower the whole entire game. It was insane. So let's see, there's no heal up. Timo placing the shrooms, very smart. But although he shouldn't die for it. Let's hope he doesn't. So Soraka is back alive. Oh, and Evelyn trying to back door. Oh crap, the Kha'Zix is gonna get... Oh, he walks into the trap! Oh my god! I was I was thinking hopefully he doesn't walk in the trap and what and he walks right into it so I think you don't get healed up if you go back to base but he should go back to base and buy some health pots in order to survive I'm kind of lagging though or I'm just walking really slow oh no it was actually the lag I told him why am I walking this slow but I'm having lag okay no oh, they shouldn't destroy our tower that would be really bad. I'm gonna pop some more health pots. So I have my ulti back up, but I'm definitely gonna wait for the Kha'Zix because he will be our main damage dealer. So I'm gonna wait for him. I'm getting having some lag again. Let's see, where is the Kha'Zix? He's standing still on base. And in the meantime, everyone is getting low. The Evelyn, getting way too greedy. I'm gonna heal my team members. Where's the Kha'Zix? He's still standing on base. What the hell is he doing? Ka, yeah, our tower's probably lost. Doing the engage and picking up the kill for the Teemo. Walking into the trap. Gonna pick the heal. And the Ka is still not here. Walking into the trap, which I didn't saw. Yeah, probably should back off here. Come on, we really need a car. If we don't have the car, we lose this game because he's like the one with the most kills. So we're gonna pick some more. I actually want to feed my Poro snack. Let's see. Yeah, there you are. Pick it up, little buddy. Yeah, there it is. The Poro I fell in love with me. Oh, okay, the Kha'Zix is back in the game. What did he bought? Hopefully he bought some strong items. I know it was quite strong on ARAM, but he should be able to pick up, like for example, uh, the Caitlyn, which was pretty low. Walk into... No, we're overstaying. Crap. Oh, Cossack's picking up the kill. Should back off too. Oh, Timo! Oh, Timo is going to die. Let's see, if we can't get a late game... Um, we really should be able to win this one actually, but we should be careful and maybe go back. I got like 3000 gold, so I'm gonna go back. I, do I think you don't heal up on ARAM and say be right back. So I'm gonna have to buy the health pots. But let's see, what are we going to buy on this mall fight? Probably a lot of tank items. For example, a Sunfire Capes would be pretty nice. Why can't I buy any items? This is ridiculous. Are you serious? Why can't I buy any freaking items? 
What the hell? Do you can you only buy items when you're dead? Oh yeah, I didn't even know this. I'm gonna ask it. Can you only buy items when dead? Hopefully they, they all answer me. So I'm gonna get Brutal Spikes because it gives me like a passive, which is pretty strong I suppose. And two seconds, I do have my ult back up. Oh, nicely combo together with the Cossex. Oh, I should get out. Oh, come on, come on, please, 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 please. Let me survive, don't walk into the trap. Okay, and we were man we managed to survive, but you know, we were really low, so we'll probably die pretty soon anyway. Oh, oh, Timo, the Timo. Oh, the Timo dies. Too bad for him. Hopefully they walk into his shrooms, because of like three shrooms, it would be insane damage. Oh, is she going to do it? Do it, come on, please. Come on, yeah, she's walking into it. Oh, crap. Do I die? No, I managed to survive. But I'm so low, it's insane. I really need a health. Or maybe I should like commit suicide or something. Don't quite know. I'm gonna wait for it. No, he has like 4.2 health regen, which is a nice amount. It's not incredible, but it's, it's decent. It's more than average, I suppose. Yeah, I'm gonna die here, right? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, no! Cramp! I really didn't fought the Nami ult went that far. But now we got a chance to pick up some items. Definitely go and go for the armor because I think the main damage dealer are Caitlyn and Jinx. Yeah, that's fully exact. And Soraka picking up lots of kills too. But we're gonna pick up that one and probably like some AP, maybe the boots. Or like two Doran's rings. Would that be good? I suppose that would be good. Although I'm gonna sell like my boots because I don't need them. I'm gonna buy full armor pot, uh, health pots. So we're pretty tanky as you can see already. We have 2000 health. Then, sadly enough, they took down our uh, tower. So let's see if we can do something. Oh, I'm lagging quite hard. And Timo walking into the traps. A real the Cossack should be able to snipe some people down. That's the only way we can actually win. Dodge the shrooms. I actually have my ulti up, so. Doing the engage and picking up the kill for the Kha'Ziggs. Oh no, oh my god, what is he doing? What is, oh my god, that was really dumb by him. That was really dumb. He went in way too far. So the Evelyn is probably somewhere over here. Yeah, it's right over here. Timo is back in the game. I'm gonna do my heal. Oh crap, I don't quite know if I held healed him or not. Uh, the sad thing is like my ulti has like insane cooldown and it's not even that very good. Okay, okay go for it. Oh, Timo, Timo, the little Yordle. Okay, Kazakh's doing nice, nice work. Oh, that's a nice amount of damage. Oh crap, I'm going in way too darn hard. Pick my health pots. Pop my health pots, I mean. Oh, great, great. Oh, man, that's awesome. Come on, Timo. Attack. Freaking attack. Okay, nice. Pop all of my health pots. I probably will get our inhibitor. Not really that much we can do against it. Okay, I have my ulti back up. And picking up a kill. Heal back up. No oh, crap, shouldn't take the harass. Ooh, Jinx missing the ult quite. Quite, uh, 
quite a lot. Oh crap. I don't wanna die! No, I survive. I still have my barrier up though. So. No, oh, Timo. Timo. The little Yordle. Which everyone hates. Okay, gonna pop my last health pot, sadly enough, so then we'll probably die. Oh, Kha'Zix. Oh, so lucky he, he he did not get into the... No! No, oh, Dryce is gonna die, yeah. Saw that one coming. Oh crap, missed my barrier. Oh, they're probably gonna end it, end it now. The puppy is not doing that much. Let's see, is there still anything we could buy? Should we go for more, some more tanky stats? I suppose we should do such a thing. Let's see, like a Randwins would be pretty good, but the Sorok is pretty fed too. Mm. I don't quite know actually. Maybe Frozen Heart? Frozen Heart might be a good option. Like, taking this one. Yeah, that's actually all we can afford. Yeah, shouldn't shouldn't be more than enough. No, I don't want to get so still Oh crap, I didn't got a kill. Sadly enough, we lost. But I don't blame anyone, you know. Didn't play that either. Uh, didn't play that good either, but probably was all about a champion, you know. <laughs> the champion was really bad. Actually, I first got Ali Star and uh, and then I like rerolled and I got uh, the Malphite. So I don't know quite know what would be the best option. I, I really thought Ali was so bad, so I, I rerolled and, and got the Ali uh, the Malphite. It was actually my first time uh, having the Malphite. So let's see how well did we do. We got 2 to 11. So we got most assists of our team at least. And uh, we died the least amount of time. So we did pretty well in that, that part. Like for example the Kha'Zix was pretty good at killing people but he died way too often. Probably I should have taken some more damage I suppose. Let's see how much damage did I take. Um, damage taken. So actually I, I took the least amount of damage of everyone. So that's probably pretty bad. I should be taking a lot more damage uh, because yeah, I'm like the tank. So, oh, and the map is actually called Holing Abyss. So I forgot that one. Here it is. And it was like 16 or 55 minutes. So it was not that long of a game, but still it was pretty good. Um, they were real strong. Like the Soraka is definitely an OP champion in uh, Holing Abyss with her heals and her mana restores. And they have the Manami, which heals too. And then they have like the insane poke from Jinx and Caitlyn. Like Evelyn, you know, Evelyn is not that good of a champion, but it's not the baddest either, you know. Like for example, Mal Malphite is probably one of the baddest champions you can have. Also like a Poppy. What, what are you going to do with a Poppy? Not that much. But anyways, we did reasonable well. Um, if you have some tips for me or comments, leave them below. I'll definitely read them and try to answer most of them. And of course, if you'd like this episode, don't forget to give it a like. And if you want to get updated on my future videos, just subscribe right below. Much appreciated. So, have a great day and have a great time. Have a great life. Thanks for watching.